Hi everyone, this is me Bilal. In this video, we will learn how to choose internal frequency of PIC microcontroller. As you know, there are many types of uh, oscillator selection available in microcontrollers. But in this tutorial, I will tell you how to choose internal internal oscillator of PIC microcontroller. If you want to know more about oscillators, then go to my website, oscillator tiles and microcontroller. I have provided the link of this article in the description of this video. And there are many types of oscillators used with big microcontroller, external resistor and internal and uh, low frequency oscillators and high frequency oscillators. But in this video, we'll discuss only how to choose internal oscillator of big microcontroller. Let's just let's check from the data sheet of PIC 18F452 and uh, go to its data sheet. It will take some time to load. Now let's go to oscillator configuration click on it and it will take you the page on where you will find the details about oscillator as you can see picatinf 4 xx2 x can be anything so picatinf 4 5 2 can be pretty in eight different oscillator modes first mean we have different eight different oscillator mode choices in this microcontroller but in this tutorial i will tell you how to how to select internal oscillator so so let's go to uh, internal oscillator mode. As you can see, this is a configuration for external oscillator and capacitor selection for oscillator. You can go through data sheet to find more details about it. External clock input, you can also connect, connect external clock input and oscillator. There is also option of oscillator switching. For example, you have connected a external hardware and there is a failure on external uh, oscillator, then device, device will automatically switch to internal oscillator. Uh, to make sure uh, it's working then so this is the OSCON register basically to set internal frequency we uh, usually need OSCON registers so let's find about internal external 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 so it means this device has no internal oscillator. As you can see from eight choices, we have no internal oscillator choice. We can search another microcontroller, PIC 18F, PIC 18F46K22. This microcontroller have internal oscillator. Let's go to its data sheet. It will take some time to open. Let's go to micro C. So, in micro C, when you build your project, go to project, edit project. Then, for example, if I select a microcontroller pick 18 f 45 then for oscillator selection, we can choose external oscillator. This twice also not have option of internal oscillator pick 18 f 46 k 2 Then, here you can see options for internal oscillator external X, xt oscillator basically internal oscillator so let's go to data sheet and click on oscillator modes so here you can see external oscillator external oscillator and internal oscillator here you can see option of internal oscillator so we can set internal oscillator also so let's go to uh, oscillator control basically when you want to use internal oscillator you have to you have to specify uh, the bits in this OSCON register for example bits bit OS, uh, bit uh, 4 5 and 6 of, of OSCON register is used to select frequency of internal oscillator okay for example if I write OSCON let's take an example for example if in code I write uh, if in code I write OSCON OSCON is equal to oscillator control is OSCON stands for oscillator control 
so if i write then i have to uh, start from this is the idle bit 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 number 7 you can write it uh, idle enable we can uh, if you want to use leave mode then you can use it otherwise otherwise you can set it as 1 0 b 0 then <coughs> then you have to choose internal oscillator frequency if if we if you if you write 1 1 1 then six frequency will be 16 hertz if you write 1 1 0 frequency will be 8 hertz and similarly then we uh, for example if we want to use 8 vector then we will write 0 of that at 1 1 1 1 0 and after that device is running from clock defined by no device is running from internal oscillator so we need to uh, set bit 3 to 0 because device is running from internal oscillator then bit 3 is also 0 now we will need to check bit 2 frequency stable yes we want uh, frequency stable and after that uh, last bit select clock select bit internal oscillator we want to use internal oscillator so we can write either as 1x or 1 0 because 1 1 or 1 0 because x is and it can be anything so 1 0 so when we set this oscon register in our code then uh, over microcontroller will be using internal oscillator